Just in time for summer. Chrissy Tomashiro has details in a story that's new at 9. It's been a rough year for many local businesses, and a few have weathered the pandemic storm. They've spent this time to revamp and renovate, like Hawaii's favorite place to cool off during the summer, Ice Palace. <laughs> to Ice Palace regulars, things might look a little different. Skates have been stored away, the snack bar removed, and the ice completely melted down. I'm surely missing that big chunk of ice during this time, summer. Hawaii's only ice skating rink has been closed for more than a year and a half. I think during Christmas it was the most difficult for me, only because uh, it, you know, the feeling of Christmas would be here in the ice palace, and from employees to customers to skaters, everyone would just feel the Christmas spirit, and. To not have that, that was difficult. So we took on a lot of projects in here uh, that we normally don't get a chance to work on, and we just use the time to improve upon the facility. Ice Palace hopes to debut a new ice rink at its anticipated reopening in September. It's not the only business hoping to turn things around in 2021. Not too far away, the Newtown Driving Range is getting ready to tee off for the first time since last March. We're just glad to be a part of this revitalization sort of, you know, but we're going to be upgrading a lot of the stuff that's going to uh, be here, you know, with, the, with this whole driving range. We're really excited. While businesses are bouncing back, there are others stuck in limbo. There's still a capacity issue or um, a gathering, the number of people that can gather. Uh, so until we get that full reopening, we're still operating under some type of capacity. And so that's why we can't, we don't see all businesses reopen uh, because they just can't under this, the current terms. The Chamber of Commerce Hawaii says there's a long road ahead, but things are looking bright. We have been seeing economic activity. It will take a lot longer to fully recover. Uh, so again, to the businesses, uh, please continue to look, push forward. And thank you for all that they're doing. Chrissy Tom Shiro, K24.